Uh, are you serious? Look at this. Look at this. Giant spike. Ah. Hey everybody, welcome to Talking Tommy. I'm Tommy D, and you guys know I love to talk. Ah, check this out. It's gonna be one of them days, huh? Look at that. Completely off the rim. Mm-hmm. Got a flat tire. So I'm gonna be down for a little bit while I wait on the tire man to get here. Um, but I'm not gonna take this as a bad omen or a bad sign. I'm gonna flip this negativity into positivity. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go ahead and uh, work on my YouTube video today. Because as you guys know, I am in a challenge with Mika Fast and Weight Loss. And uh, she has made me have to be accountable and responsible today for uploading the video. So, um, Let's get on to it. I'm going to I'm going to jump inside my truck so I'm not uh walking around in the parking lot and uh, we'll take it from there. Welcome guys to my channel. This is typically not my normal setup. I have to apologize, but due to unforeseen circumstances here, it's out of my control. As you know, I got a flat tire, so hey, I'm just going to go ahead and make my video right here from my truck. Um those of you who don't know me, I'm talking Tommy, and I just wanna say thank you for all those people that have come over from Mika's channel and wherever you've come from to visit me. I'm on a weight loss journey. It's been ups and downs, trials and tribulations, but every day uh, I'm better and better, and I'm thankful for that. I was, I was scrolling through my phone. Um, I saw a video that me and my son made for the Ellen DeGeneres show. Um, we were trying to get on Ellen DeGeneres. We were just joking around one night and uh, we made this video and it really represents where I'm coming from and how big I was. So take a look at this video right here, guys. Hey, Ellen, this is Tommy. I'm Tom. I I'm big Tom. I'm little Tom. Yeah, and we want to get on Ellen's Game, Game of games. games. So we're watching your show right now, yeah. and we think we can do it. Mm -hmm. Can we do it, Tom? Yeah, yeah. We can do it. We can do it. So Ellen. This is his idea. He's crazy. Just. I, I got to do it. I'm a big <laughs> fan. I love Ellen. Ellen, we love you. Yes. And uh, we got to get on your show. He's just trying to become famous. Don't listen to him now. <laughs> I am trying to become famous. He's just trying to become famous. Look how little TJ was. Man, he was just a little guy. I miss those days. Look at me, I was a big guy. I slimmed down quite a bit. So what I want to talk to you guys about really quick are three tips to starting your first 24 hour fast. Every time I go into this, my body reacts different it seems like, but there's three things that you can do to make this somewhat of a smooth sailing for you. Uno! Another loneliest number. Number one, eat a big meal the day before. And when I say big meal, I mean a big meal. Okay, but there's a difference between a big meal and an unhealthy meal. You wanna give your body the nourishment that it needs, okay? You wanna eat some healthy things throughout the day, um, a one big meal, however you wanna do it, but the day before, you want to fill your body up with plenty of nutrients. Number two, deuces, dose, dose, dose. Number two, plan ahead. This really, really helps out. We're talking 24 hours without any food. Being home on that 24 hour fast is not ideal at all. I would rather be at work. It keeps my mind focused all throughout the day. I'm not thinking about eating, so the fast becomes that much more easier. However, if I was home all day long, I'm constantly thinking about food. I want to run to the refrigerator and grab something to eat. So that's what I mean by plan ahead. Look on your calendar and say, okay, what day is going to be best for me? Where I'm not going to be interrupted, I'm not going to be distracted, or, or maybe you will be distracted and interrupted. Whatever you think is best beneficial for you in your mind, plan that day out. <laughs> tip number three, big tip here, snake juice. The secret weapon to fasting, snake juice, especially if you're doing a prolonged fast. It replenishes the minerals and electrolytes in your body. From getting those crazy migraines, the hunger pains, this will help out a lot with that because your body's gonna have the minerals and nutrients that you need. It's just a bunch of minerals inside some water, basically. And that's really, really simple to make, really, really easy. Um, but definitely, definitely a must. I would say drink that. That's really gonna help you get through this. All right, guys, I'm gonna stop talking. Those are your tips for your first 24 hour fast. Okay, so now we need to find out how me and Mika are doing. Well, first, I wanna say that I am feeling pretty good, actually. Um, diarrhea, okay? <laughs> diarrhea has seemed to be an issue right now. I'm not sure if it's the apple cider or uh, the snake juice, or just the pure water, or 
It's just my body's way of reacting. I'm not really sure what's going on. But other than that, I feel pretty good. I got plenty of energy. Um, I've been really excited. I just found out last night what we were gonna do with the whole uh, fast. Those of you who haven't seen that video, go check that video out. We have to do an hour of fitness, so I didn't get much fitness in. What I had to do, guys, what I actually had to do was turn on the TV and have the app, uh, Just Dance app. So I was in there just dancing. That is hilarious to watch. Maybe sometime I'll videotape it for you. And then I just did push-ups, uh, 20 push-ups. So that was all the fitness I did yesterday. So that means I need to go double time today. However, Mika, as usual, she killed it in that department. Um, <laughs> exercise queen. Uh, I'm going to let you guys look at that. Take, take a look at this. All right, so um, our weigh-in is, <sighs> I'm not allowed to say. You have to tune in to Mika Fast and Weight Loss's channel tomorrow to get our update weight after our first 24 hours of fasting. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you for subscribing. I guess I'll see you guys in a couple days. Hopefully, I'll be out of this truck.